it's so important that you're at home in your own kitchen. And one of the ways to do that is embrace the simpler, more efficient ways to get things done. For example, just cutting up an onion. Some people really have a hard time getting an even chop. So today, I'm going to show you exactly how to do that. First of all, make sure your knives are sharp. That's one of your best tools, and it's going to make things nice and fast for you. So first, we're going to take this onion and chop it right down the center, just like this, okay? Now, this is going to help this side that we're not gonna use stay fresher because the root end is still intact. So put this in a baggie, stick it in the refrigerator. Now we're gonna take this other half and we're gonna cut the other end off, come right over here to our garbage bowl and start pulling off the outer edge, the layer. Just like Shrek says, right? I'm an onion. <laughs> so that's the first thing you want to do. Just pull this all off, OK? Now, this is the cool part. And this is how you get the nice, even chop. First of all, carefully, go ahead and take your knife. And as big as your chop is, you just want to evenly go right down the middle of the onion, just like this. By the way, if you cry easily, you can always do this running under cold water, and that'll help to keep the tears away. All right, so we've got this all cut this way. Now we're going to cut it horizontally. So it's really important, once again, safety in the kitchen. So make sure that you keep your hand away from your sharp knife, put it right on top, and start cutting this way, OK, just like this. Maybe three times, two to three times, depending on how big your onion is, OK? Now check this out. We're just going to start chopping just like this. And look what happens. We have a beautiful, even chop. So if you're sautéing or you're sprinkling this into a salad, you know exactly how long you're going to cook it and what your guest is going to take. It's just that simple. I'm Angel, and I'll see you next time with another great tip for your kitchen at home.